This is a solution for sending invoices, emailing them and filing them away. For this particular example, I'm using document management link to show me the invoices for the associated customer. I'm using notes to house and show the results of an extender script to print the, print the invoice and PDF it and rename it based on the invoice number and then to email the invoice. It is my choice that I'm doing these as two steps, not as one step, but I could have had this customized to do uh, the printing and emailing at the click of one button. And I'm using extender behind this to do the work. So when I'm on an invoice, which is showing the, uh, on an order, which is showing the invoice number, which as you can see is not yet printed, I can click the print button which will create the PDF and file it away in document management link storage. So it will be filed away in this particular folder. Next time I review this folder, I will see invoice 29 stored there. So if I just uh, step off and step uh, back onto this particular uh, vendor's documents, invoices, I'll see now that that invoice 29 was created. And now I can email it. So when I click on email, it's going to the customer's preferences to see which email address to use and sending off that particular email. The format of the email is defined by an email template in Extender. So if I go to the email, I should see the email uh, being sent through. And here is the email, which is attached uh, invoice uh, 29. Double click on that to make sure it's the right invoice. So it's invoice number 29 for customer 1200. And this is the text of the, of the email, which is defined in the extender email template.